Chances are anyone who's lived or worked in Baltimore has seen the running man. He's a fixture in the city and is always on the move. 64-year-old Keith Boissier has run 20 miles a day for the last 30 years. There's a lot of people like to honk their horns at me and wave and, and call out to me and a lot of that. People see him and they smile. Well, man. Hey, that's good man there. <laughs> I see him all over the place. How you doing, partner? Others stop by to give him gifts. We appreciate you. Mm. We just want to let you know. Good job. Mm. Blessings to you. Right. Well, yes, CA, originally from Trinidad and Tobago, started running to improve his health. He has chronic kidney disease and is on a waiting list for a donor. In the meantime, he has a fistula in his arm in case he needs dialysis. And they join an artery and a vein together. Boissier right? says his doctors encourage him to run. He has two siblings who died from heart disease, and he's hoping to hold that off. Plus, he loves the way his four-hour runs make him feel. The body feels so nice that, you know, that's how you want to feel. You don't need to um, do drugs to feel good. So what do you hope people see when they see running man coming down the streets of Baltimore doing his 20 miles or so a day. Well, I would like to inspire them to do something with their lives. Rather than a few weeks ago, the city council wanted Boissier to know just how much the city loves him. They presented him with an award recognizing that his sport inspires Baltimore neighborhoods, an award he's very proud of. And get this, he's known to run further than 20 miles. Something I run to DC and I get like, you run to D.C.? Yeah, one way. And, get the, and jump on the greyhound and come back. Keith Bossier, running man. Inspiration is his middle name. Lisa Robinson, WBAL-TV 11 News. Inspiration.